Howdy folks, welcome back to the Taylor Brooks Road of the Show Series here on MLB 22 P 23 PS5 episode 16. We have got a decision in every single start. That's the craziest part of this year. We are 13-2. and two. We throw seven strong innings. Uh, in the eighth, we gave up a two-run shot, um, but it was 7 nothing at the time, so we held on fine. It's an 8-3 to three final. We head into July. Taylor's taking off the sleeves. He's ready to go. He's close to a 70 overall. Um, so let's just move on and see what we can do. Uh, in terms of skill set, we are at 28 out of the needed 100 for the gold tree. Uh, I need seven more Ks. Yeah. We're making progress. We'll see how it goes. All right, let's get into this. Richmond is the team we're going to be playing. Two seam control, nah. Uh, speed, nah. This might help, though, doing all three of these, but those are going up at a fine pace. Honestly, the 12-6 control is not going to go up at all, so I, I think I'm going to rock with that and the walks per nine. All right, we're not just going to aim for the catcher's glove today. We are going to look on the corners and stuff. The team is 42-33, and 33, so we're playing well, but Richmond is also 42-33. and 33. So let's get out here on one. Heck yeah, big music. All right, we're at Green Valley Stadium. I'm going to have to skip this because that's enough to get demonetized. Jonathan Bermudez is 8-4. Here's Brett Auerbach. Auerbach. All right, I think we faced Richmond before. I'm going to assume we're not going to throw... A wild pitch. We'll open today by looking to the spot. Thank you, Blue. That's a bad call. Honestly, I kind of like hitting the spot. Why not keep it going? Well, that's why. We'll, we'll hit the spot, and then when we want to change it up, we will. It's foul. And we're missing over the plate. All right. One, two. We just threw the fastball. Let's throw the slider. It's a good one. Foul ball. Connor Norby's got it. Ooh, that was called solid contact. I strongly disagree, but one down. Not Connor Norby. Colin. Here's Jordan Waller, who's absolutely raking here in double A. This dude obviously has the potential. He's a 66 overall. He's a 20-year-old. And he's just absolutely crushing the ball. Jordan Lawler. Put that 600 Future probably 85, 88 overall player. We'll just have to see. Go for it, Taylor. That's down and in. One one. So a foul ball makes it one and two. All right, we've got two on him. Let's not make a mistake. This won't miss too far over the plate. And it's two misses to even the count. It's ball two. Come on, Blue. Next offering way off the plate. Big twelve six to Jordan Lawler. Gets a piece and stays alive. Huh, I wish umpire would have gave us that call. Oh no. Not good. Yes, he did. Oh, come on, man. Uh. Here's Steven Piscotti. I love that pitch. Don't miss over the plate. That one is absolutely belted. That's bad. 
and out of here. Yeah. Fourth home run of the season. Just like that, they move in front. Not it's cool, blue. Not gonna blame the homer on you, but that guy should not have reached base. Tough start. Yeah, that's a terrible pitch. And the former big leaguer Stephen Piscotti goes deep. Jared Dupier. Alright, we gotta bounce back now, Taylor. Slapped foul. Can't make pitches like that. Oh, oh two fastball out. And that's gonna get down. That one gets down for a hit. Uh, sometimes it's just not gonna work for you, man. Even through that 94. There really aren't a lot of base hits on balls hit like that, but. There's always a little room back behind the first and second baseman to drop a lawn dart in there, and he found a way. That's a double play. It's 2 nothing Richmond as we give up the bomb to straightaway center. Tough call for one of the runs scoring, but it is what it is. 2 nothing Flying Squirrels. Ford Proctor. That's a name. The right hander back to work. Huh. That's a terrible pitch. Strike one. Looks like he's just sizing him up there. Really good pitch to hit, but he took it all the way. Sometimes guys just want to set their timing. Gosh, Taylor, you gotta you gotta hit better than that. O2 to Proctor. Change up. Got it up the middle, and that's a hit. Holy cow. You gotta hit your spots, Taylor. I mean at least if you're going to miss, miss out of the zone. But our misses today have all been. And that was a good pitch, though. So. Oh, well. Slider. There you go. See, that miss is okay. Proctor on at first. Nobody out. Next offering is in for a strike. That's a great take right there. Even though it's a strike, with the situation, runner on first base, you want to keep the ball off the ground. That's uh, on the ground. It's a double play. To second, and they get him easily All right, nicely it's done. Play. We'll take it. 3-6-3, three, three, and Shane Matheny steps up. So, two down here. Next pitch downstairs. It's well low. Well. One oh. Now one and one. One ball, one strike. Right back to it. Slider's kind of been placed well today. Next one Whoa, misses, right and it's two and one. Hope you all are enjoying the series. If you haven't, oh. wow, Blue gives me that one. He's pretty bad today. Next off Anyways, um, what was I gonna say? On the ground, right side. Just and foul. foul. He's way out in front. Left if you haven't gone and checked out the Alex series, go check it out. It's been a good time. Yes, he did. All right, good second. Giving up the hit and getting double play and a strikeout. We'll take it. So, moving on to the third here. Back here at the ballpark. And here's the first baseman, Patrick Bailey. The pitch. That's inside. 1 0. Bailey measures 6 feet 2 inches, 205 pounds, and he's usually a catcher. The Alex series is going on into. Close to June now for year 10. Of course, this one in year one. And we're just now getting into July, so. We've got a lot of uh, ground to make up with Taylor. And we're playing five games an episode over there with Alex, so it's going to the same pace. Every now and then there's a four. Playoffs won't be quite as long. So Taylor might catch him by 
in total like a third of a season. <laughs> Strike two. Uh, One, two, right over there. the course of like a long time. You chase that, you'll chase this. One, two, it's pretty well placed. Got him. Thank you, Blue. That was a strike. That was not a friendly strike three. Ah, it's a little friendly. Here's Jordan Lawler, who got the lucky walk last time. Ninety-one, right in there. Getting the first two outs. Want to get this number two hitter? Get back in the dugout to face three, four, five next inning. All right, one, two. That's a terrible pitch. That one to first. But we'll get third out here. All right. So a quick three up, three down here in the third. He has yet to put anything up. Probably looking at another decision. Blow by. Piscotti went deep last time. Got to be careful. He's going to go up the middle here. Might get into that gap, but he's not too fast. So it'll be a single. Did that stay over the plate? I thought that caught a good spot. And it was... But still a nice job of using the big part of the field to find a hole. No way he hits it that well if he hooks around the baseball there. So 1 0. Next one from Taylor is inside 2 0. Piscotti gets his lead at first with nobody out. The 2 0 is Got him upstairs at 93. That's flown out to left center and two down. Or one down, sorry. Brett Wisely, who are you? First offering and it just misses. One down, one down. I believe he hit into a double play his first time up. Pitch. Swing and a miss. Good pitch, Taylor. Go get him. Well, the hitter shows the pitcher that he's willing to go get him with 12 6. It's a good pitch. Perhaps he'll come back to it. Still try to get that ground ball double play. And he deals. Blow by upstairs. Only 91, but a strike number three. So we'll get a K there. Fastballs in that location. Hitters, especially with two strikes, have to be. Or Proctor. Did not go. Now as he looks at ball one. Second plate appearance of the day for him. Next offering is in for a boy Taylor. At the belt and fires. They say you win. One ball, two strikes. Go for it, Taylor. The next pitch misses. That's a good pitch. Can't even be mad with it. Upstairs. So, 3 2. He goes. Big 12 6. See, it walked him. Doesn't want to give him something over the plate. Luis Matos takes one right down the middle. Ugh. 0 2. He can get through this one, put up a zero. This will help in his outings to come. One ball. Gonna count one two and two. Two down now. Haven't felt confident with 12-6 all day. Let's go change up. Got him. Yes, sir. Good pitch, Taylor. Gets out of some trouble there. Stallings. Did we get Jacob Stallings? Welcome back. Is that Jacob Stallings behind the plate? Um, wait, where's Stallings? Oh, is Stallings on the other team? Oh, maybe it's a pitcher? Yeah, Garrett Stallings. Okay, he's a 25-year-old. He's not very good. <laughs> Who knows what happened there, but Shane Matheny will be the hitter. Oh, one. 
this outing started off a little shaky, but he's found yeah, we've we've bounced back well. Let's just get through this fifth. Kind of shows you a lot about his mental makeup as a pitcher. If you're gonna miss up, miss up up. Next offering upstairs. One ball, two strikes. All right, one two to Matheny. God, I'm on the changeup. That's disgusting. Yeah, we're gonna start getting those relationships with everybody. One down. That was kind of a disgusting changeup. Let's throw another one. Same spot, but outside. Let's go right back to it. Good eye right there. That's where you want. It's a good miss. Nine hole, let's get this in there. There you go. Way behind that one. Two one. Thanks, Bloop. All right. He knows he messed up earlier. 12-6. Come on. Work, daggum it. I have enough faith in the slider. 3-2. It's fouled off. If you can place this, Taylor, it'll be filthy. He can't. All right. One on, one down. You've got a guy who's over 2 up at the plate. Don't hang it. Uh-oh. Expect in this 3 0 count, you're taking all the way. See if they walk you in for a strike now. Three and one kicks and fire. Three one, and he wants it. Ball four. We walk another one. It feels to me like his time on the oh wow, they pull sure. us that early. Oh, tough day for Taylor. Four and a third, two earned, maybe more. And it'll be Garrett Stallings. Okay, the guy we just got a relationship with. Richmond wins. And they did put up one more. So Taylor gives up three earned. Walked four, gave up four hits. Five Ks and four and a third. Definitely a step back on his on a start. That was not that was not what we want to see. Um ugh. All right, that's all right. Those happen sometimes. Just couldn't hit our spots. So they made us pay. Just wait till the MLB, man. Jeez. We're going to get absolutely shredded. So definitely not completing much of a perk tree today. We are uh, still one and three. Or we are still a um, great winning record. We're 13 and three is... Uh, player and we are a game back on the flying squirrels as they have hopped into first the senators are a game behind us and the big o's are back in the win column they are in the winning graces they're 43 and 41 a little over halfway through the season uh two games back in the wild card so there's a chance they play for uh play for something this year as a team up there um we are the number we're the ace and buoy we should be in uh, AAA, but I guess not. Good to see the Josiah Gray's pitching well, though. Uh, Povich is pitching decent, too. He's got a chance to be something. Uh, Seth Johnson, not as much, but Josiah Gray and uh, maybe Kyle Bradish could... Well, no, probably not. Josiah Gray and Povich, the two best guys in AAA. But in the MLB, John Means has looked really good this year again. Kyle Gibson hasn't been great. Grayson Rodriguez has some growing pains to go through, but uh, he'll definitely be better. Just give him some time. Cole Irvin's been really good, and Dean Kramer's been all right. Uh, D.L. Hall's up there as well now. Tyler Wells. Uh, terrible reliever. Darwin's and Hernandez. Why is he even getting an opportunity, man? Bryn Baker. Who is that? Uh, Dylan Tate's been good, as has Michael Givens, Sion Perez, and Felix Bautista has been pretty locked down. 24 saves to just the one blown, a 1 7 1 ERA. Good job. And for the lineup, um, 
We're looking at Cedric Mullins leading off. Decent year. Adam Frazier hitting a good average. You know what he does. Adley Rutschman is all right. Uh, 768 OPS. You know he's great in the field. Uh, Anthony Santander is having himself a year uh, hitting the ball for power. 24 homers already. Drove in 64. Love to see it. Ryan Mountcastle's been really good. Um, not really good, but he's been pretty good. Uh, Gunnar Henderson hitting only against righties, I believe. No, he's now in the lineup against lefties as well. So that explains the lower average, but I like Gunnar. I think he's doing all right. He's playing some shortstop out there. He's pretty good. Ramon Orias, uh, Austin Hayes looks okay. And then Franchi Cordero, when he gets to play, is all right. James McCann sucks. Westberg doesn't get enough time to really tell. Nice. And then Dylan Beavers. <laughs> Who are you? See potential. Maybe he could be something. Who knows? All right, so the team's all right. They're going to develop. They're going to sign some people. But that's it for me. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That's Taylor Brooks, episode 16 in the books.